What's up guys, Barry Gaming here, back with some more Idle Heroes, and today we're on the free to play account, but before we even talk about that, there's something that I actually missed in the patch notes, which would have been absolutely huge if they would have done sooner, however, there was one little note on the function updates that I get to the point, I don't even read the function updates because it almost like there's never an actual function update it's just like oh arania is now in such and such arania is now acquirable here uh there are two things that are coming this week uh the first one being in the glorious relic shop right next to this crown here we are finally gonna have melodic strings it's been like 10 months or so i think nine ten months since it came out and uh yeah it looks like that is going to be one of the new features I don't know if that's going to do anything on our free-to-play account, but on the average player's account, that is going to be a very, very big deal. The other thing is in Ace Championship. Uh, that's going on right now. In the store, you will see a brand new skin pop up, and that will be for the Shaho that we talked about earlier in the week. We, we kind of showed off. He's like a mecha, samurai, whatever. It will make him a more worthwhile tenant as well because as you guys know when you take a look over here and you jump into here especially for like vesa uh he is one of them if you don't have spare transcendence heroes to throw in there but without the skin you're missing out on so many stats because it's, it's not a big deal on this account but a lot of accounts have crazy high amounts of fixed stats that you can pump into the hero just by equipping a skin to a hero uh so not only are you getting the bonuses of the skin but you're also getting these fixed rates the hp being the really big one because it can get really really insane so make sure you guys check those out uh if that's all you guys came here for that's the two pieces of news we got however we're going to continue jumping on to our free to play here and see what we have to do we've been buying up everything in our purgatory shop here uh that has to do with both promotion stones and wishing coins wishing coins were coming away with actually quite a few uh, we're almost coming to that really important break point of being able to do eight loops, which is like 2100-ish, somewhere in that ballpark. Uh, and then promotion stones, we're just storing back up so that we're ready to build more heroes. 333 relics, we're looking at a good spot there. We're sitting on a sphere, a couple cores, and of course, crystals of transcendence. Uh, one thing I want to do, though, we have a decent amount of stellar shards kind of adding up. I want to improve our store, star swordsman Mockman and see how much further up we can get him. Not much. Um, so it's interesting here. We are kind of stuck between going for sublimation and just more actual spiritual essence on this guy. With the upcoming event next week, we don't have that many Profit Orbs, so we're not even going to get that many points. I mean, we might be able to do one special Soul Awakening with that new currency that's coming this week. Plus, on top of that, we're only sitting on... Where are my contracts? Sorry, Jim. 650. We'll be able to get up to like 900, maybe 1,000 total. Uh, that's not going to be enough to hunt after the pay to one artifact just because in reality you want to try to have like 30 summons so i think this week on the free to play is going to be an idle session we do however have our void arc ending which means we will be able to upgrade some more of our star spawn here uh we're kind of stuck on those here we'll probably get the spirit of fervor up the abyss one just because it gives you that percentage attack and that just seems really really good and uh yeah we just need more eggs because we only have just over half of the star spawn even unlocked uh yeah so all that's looking good we do however have our monthlies finally reset so we're gonna be able to get more gems we can get more scrolls and profit orbs which is nice uh wow we actually had two of the seven stars complete but we only have two of five of the six stars we'll have to get into that and we can do fusions and broken spaces all that fun stuff however there's one thing we need to do before today ends and that is we need to jump in and we need to see how our imps adventure goes however we did not save any gems up for this mainly because well I feel like going for this chest actually isn't even that important for us anymore just because most of the heroes on this account we're gonna build are light and dark and I just don't feel like we have a way to get there so the main point is getting to 2500 that'll be very easy so we're just gonna save our gems on our imps adventure right now however there are a lot of things on this board that we do need for rewards and if we somehow manage to hit some really good rewards then cool wow wow we actually hit the dice first trip around the map that is 
Interesting. Um, now nah, we'll just take the two. We'll take the guaranteed two. We've got two of our mushroom starry huts up to level two, which isn't bad. It's not too bad. Can we get double movement? Nope. We go backwards. Okay. Yeah. This this just solidifies my idea of yeah. We're not gonna bother really caring about this event, especially with these rolls. What is happening? Oh, that's a pretty good roll. <laughs> That's actually not that bad. If we get like a one or a two here. Two, I'll take it. It's free movement. Can we get another three? Nope. We got six, which means we can do this. Not bad. I mean, we're still going to probably get some decent rewards here. But in reality, we just don't care too much on this account. Because, I mean, we don't have the gems anyway even to decide if we would want to or not. So we're just going to take our free stuff and then start saving up more gems because basically what we've been doing with our gems is just been buying cores of transcendence at this point not saving up for special events or anything like that just straight up cores of transcendence and i might have bought some stuff in our celestial expedition uh yeah i might have done that so we, we're gonna have some more cores some more resources, all that fun stuff coming our way in like eight hours or so because, well, I think we're about done with the trip. Oh my God, we're in like a hate loop back here. We can't even get out of it. Oh my God, we keep going in a loop. Oh, finally. All right, I think we can make it around the board one more time. Not with those types of rules. Oh God, okay, so maybe we didn't. <laughs> Wait a minute, maybe we didn't. Did we do the entire shelter mission? We did. Oh man. One, two, three, four, five, six. More four star shards. Yeah. Or we could just go into more five star shards and just go for a two. Yeah, why not? We're not gonna get any more. We'll just go with the two. Grab our last spot. We only got 105. Good lord. Although I did see someone get like 72 or something with their free dice, which is pretty crazy. Um <sighs> Actually, oh good lord, I hope we get 70 more today. <laughs> oh no, I just realized that. Oh man, maybe we should have spent some gems here. But like, we can only get what? Five dice? Oh man, I should have gone for further progress. Okay, never mind. Whew, we got it, we got it guys. All right, so that's an extra 50. Never mind, we had to spend a little gems. <laughs> but that'll pay off because we should be able to get another 20 and the important part is getting this glory epic chest for our free to play so i think that's pretty good uh let me know what you guys think about your free to play progress as well i love hearing how you guys are performing if you guys are still playing along we'll be starting a new one towards the end of the year so definitely keep an eye out for that hopefully you guys enjoy this one i'll see you guys next time make sure you buy your melodic strings Thank you.